D1 maths for class 6 or 7 and book page number is 144. Exercise 6a and question number is 3. The equation of a function is y is equal to 4x plus 5. Find the value of y when x is equal to 3. So this is D1 maths for class 6 book page 144. If you have not yet opened the book, you can open the book. The equation, first read the question. The equation of a function is y is equal to 4x plus 5. Find the value of y when x is equal to 3. So first of all, we shall write the function. What is the function? This is the function because the equation of a function is, they have already said that this is a function. So y is equal to 4x plus 5 is a function we have to find the value of y we have been when we have been given x is equal to 3 if we have been given x is equal to 3 that's mean in place of x we shall write 3 this is x right this is x in place of x we shall write 3 and everything shall remain as it is there is no effect on other things Four is being multiplied with three. Four three times twelve and plus five. Twelve plus five will be seventeen. So we have gained the value of seventeen. When we have gained the value of seventeen, when we have put x is equal to three, in place of x there is three, and in place of x when we have put x is equal to three, we have gained y is equal to seventeen. Since we are doing the graph related chapter, so it is understood that we have to represent this point on a piece of graph paper. Uh, you shall draw a grid first. Uh, you can draw a suitable grid according to the point because in the point we have x is equal to 3 and y is equal to 5. Remember the first digit also always represent x and the second digit always represent y we have to go till 17 on y axis that means we need only positive values of y we need only positive values of y and we need only positive values of x so we shall draw a very little portion for negative values of y suppose this is y axis and this is x axis and how i has drawn y axis because we have only positive value of uh, y which is 17 it will be available above the origin above this 0 17 will be available like here this is you can say this is uh, 5 oh sorry this is 1 even you can give the gaps of uh, 2 2 like this is 2 this is 4 this is 6 this is 8 this is 10 this is 12 this is 14 i can extend it even this is 16 and this is 18 how i have drawn this you can see you can see it clearly 2 4 6 8 10 12 14 16 and 18 similarly with the same gap, I shall draw values of x. Positive 2, positive 4. Minus 2, minus 4. And on negative, x, uh, negative values of y shall be drawn like this. Minus 2 and minus 4. Now we shall come at the uh, main point which we have to draw the x value and uh, we have to show the x, x we have to show this point on our grid 3 and 17 first of all you should go at the x axis and at x axis you have to go till 3 3 will be available in between 4 and 2 suppose suppose this is 3 3 will be available between 2 and 4 now we have to go till 17 from 3 we shall go till 17 will be available between 16 and 18. So this is the point which is we have.